Well, today, hundreds of parents and students were out in support of teachers at a pro-arbitration rally at the Vancouver Art Gallery. They are frustrated, they are angry, and they want kids back in class. CTV's Julie Nolan has the story. We need children in British Columbia to be back in school next week as soon as possible. A vibrant and vocal rally, even while the two sides hold marathon talks. If it fails again this weekend, I'd like binding arbitration because our kids can't wait. Those kids say they can't wait and showing their sarcasm over ramifications of a dispute that's dragging on. That means that we have approximately missed 12% of an entire school year. Please forgive me if my percentage is wrong. I haven't been in a math class for three months. Nearly everyone here says they've had enough. Parents worried about their kids' education and teachers just want to go back to work. This march echoes the overwhelming vote by teachers last week to end the dispute by arbitration. While the government says it won't rule out back-to-work legislation. I don't have a lot of faith in, the part, in Christie's government to make things happen short of binding arbitration. Well, everyone can see now crystal clear that um, families are not first. So families say they're left to wonder if they've fallen by the wayside in the strike. On a scale of 1 to 10, how frustrated are you? Uh, 10-ish. I became very disenchanted and very angry when I heard that the government would not participate in binding arbitration. I like the community aspect of school and I also like learning, so yeah, I definitely am ready to go back. Now into the third week of the dispute, BC students are still frozen out of their classrooms and in dire need of their education. Julie Nolan, CTV News, Vancouver.